Like many other shows and video games, some content created doesn't make it into the final show. This video was made for people who don't know much about the behind the scenes of BFDI. Also, this video is massively inspired by Tetra Bit Gaming's Lost Bit series, where he lists unused and unseen content in video games, so make sure to check him out. Also, a like and subscribe would be very much appreciated since these videos take a long time to make. Enjoy the video. Let's start off with some unused and unseen content in the first season, BFDI. An alternate cut of the balance beam contest depicted pin winning Dream Island. Here's a clip. For scissors. Rock beats scissors. I get to push you off. We didn't agree to that. Only one of us can win. Pin alliance. Not this time, Leafy. What you said. Oh gosh. And yeah. Ha. This might be how BFDI was originally supposed to end being only one episode. By looking at the FLA file of the scene Leafy mistakenly steps on Blocky's foot, you can see Leafy has abnormal eyes, which are never seen during the actual video. Originally, the squashy cherries and squashy grapes were supposed to be called the yelling beavers and murder trout, these names are a parody of the total drama island teams, the screaming gophers and killer base. A face similar to yellow face was supposed to appear during the scene Pin asked what is a win token, which turned into a frown in the last few frames. In the episode Puzzling Mysteries, two rejoins were cut, Blocky and Woody were supposed to rejoin, I'll play the clip. We're gonna pick Spongy, right? Absolutely! He would like that, wouldn't he? Woody! He wouldn't hate it, would he? Woody! Woody? Okay, you choose Woody. No, no, we choose Spongy! Too late, Carries. I know you aren't done with your jigsaw puzzle, but take a break and choose an eliminated player onto your team. We choose Blocky! Yeah! Naoli's original design had no legs and the body was sideways, I can't imagine how Naoli would look like nowadays with this design. Jack and Jellify released some scrapped scenes for people who want to audition for audio editors, one being an alternate introduction to space, the second being Rocky surviving elimination, and fiery and flower speaker boxes killing announcer. That was all the known scrap materials from BFDI, moving onwards to the second season, battle for Dream Island again. When Pencil brings out her leafy detector to catch Leafy, Evil Leafy was originally supposed to appear behind the background trees, Evil Leafy never appears there in the actual video since Evil Leafy was put on a guide layer, which doesn't show up once the file gets exported. In the FLA file there is a picture file called Screeny, which is the first frame from the BFDI intro, most likely used for reference when making the BFDIA intro. A drawn picture of a legless gelatin can be seen in the object library, it's most likely the original design for gelatin, being armless. When Yellowface reads the BFDI game rules, the fourth rule appears out of screen and says no reading ahead. This is probably a little easter egg for people who look through the FLA files. A BFDI fan managed to discover the original script for BFDI A5, it was originally going to be released in even smaller chunks, and 5B was originally an episode, and not a game, more things were also changed. Putting Nickel and Coiny together was originally supposed to spawn evil leafy clones, but was instead changed to be a portal to money. The negative viewer comment for match was originally by a different person called Nicholas Chatterton, and not Epic Faceness 483. After Pin lost her limbs, Book was supposed to say LOL instead of HAHA like she said in the final episode. But these are some changes that occurred around the time of the script's rewrite, I'm going to explain the deleted script for BFDIA 5B, with some bad animation for a more clear picture of what the episode probably would have looked like. Once the challenge wheel was ready to be spun, Ruby tried to spin it, but it didn't budge, Book finds out it had a password that belonged to the puffball speaker box, according to the back of the wheel, Fries was supposed to remove the knife from the puffball speaker box, after much struggle, Fries was able to pull out the knife, but it flies out, flying over some contestants, ricocheting back off the swings, and sent back to the puffball speaker box, Fries tries to pull it out again, he successfully removed the knife, but shattered ice cube in the process, the recovery center starts making weird noises, 
before activating a siren, Tennis Ball is freaked out at the state of the HPRC, but meanwhile, Puff Ball speaker box was revived, Fires asked if she could unlock the wheel, Puff Ball speaker box agrees and unlocks it, Tennis Ball states that the HPRC will start delimbifying, meaning that limbs will fly out of the machine, the delimbification starts and limbs fly everywhere. Puffball speaker box gets tossed onto the spikes of Evil Canyon, and the cast begins panicking, suddenly, Evil Leafy teleports above Golf Ball, making her faint, Evil Leafy sinks into Golf Ball and create clones of herself, Gelatin quickly spins the wheel before it's too late, ending off the episode, there is way more to this original script, probably enough to make a whole video, but let's continue with IDFB, there isn't much more though. In BFB16, one of the recommended characters is called Meatball, but when looking into the files, the asset was created back in 2013, around the time BFDIA6 was created. This might indicate Meatball was an abandoned character meant to appear in BFDIA6. Grassy was going to have a different asset for IDFB, which looks like this, but Carrie decided to keep using the asset used in the original BFDI as he thought it looked better. That's the end of this video, if you would like to see a second part to this video, covering BFB and Teapot, let me know by subscribing, liking the video, and posting a comment, see you later.